It's a deadly product that devastated a local family. We're talking about something that was blamed for suffocating children, and tonight we have discovered it's still being sold three years after it was recalled. Amy Frazier tonight goes undercover to show you what to watch out for in our Coin 6 investigation. 911, what's your emergency? Oh, my God. Oh, my baby's not living. Wait, where are you? I'm in Costco's parking lot. Please. Their heartbreak was unimaginable. Kaiser parents, whose six day old son suffocated in 2009 in a baby sling meant to help them bond. I wish I could go back every day to the day that I went shopping and never bought that. The Consumer Product Safety Commission tracked three baby deaths to the infantino sling rider in one year, pulling them from store shelves in 2010. But three years later, we've discovered the deadly product is still out there. This is undercover video of the recalled baby sling illegally sold at a Michigan franchise of Once Upon a Child, the nation's largest children's resale chain. Their response? I am very proud of our girls. They all go through our buyer certification. And then how could this have happened? I believe that it was just an error. Once Upon a Child also has locations locally. We wanted to know if potentially deadly errors were happening here. We went undercover, searching through the racks at the Salem store, but did not find the recalled slings. The same was true at the Once Upon a Child store in Vancouver, where again, no Infantino sling riders were for sale. With those stores clear, we took our investigation online. One place we did find the recalled baby sling here locally is on Craigslist. In fact, I'm about to go to a home in Dallas, Oregon to see if I can purchase one right now. According to the Consumer Product Safety Commission, it's against the law for anyone to sell a recalled product. Here it is. I purchased it for just $10. Now I want to go back up to the seller to see if she knew this was a recalled product. Very surprised. Very surprised. Yeah. As a mother herself, you know, no, Amber Kayla felt and terrible so, hearing about the babies who have died in the Infantino Sling Rider. So in terms of selling more baby items on Craigslist, will you do anything differently next time? Absolutely. I will definitely check to see if anything has been recalled before I sell it because I don't want that to happen to somebody else's child. And that's exactly what the owner of Back on the Rack in Hillsboro does before she accepts consignments from sellers. She uses the Consumer Product Safety Commission website to double check, yep. something anyone can do to weed out recalled products like the Infantino Sling Rider. Probably the last one I saw was maybe maybe two months ago, but yeah, they do come in quite often. Not. Thank you. That was Amy Frazier reporting. And remember, if you also want to research products that you may be considering to sell or even to buy, you can check that Consumer Product Safety Commission's website. And we have a link to that tonight on our website, coin.com.